Hi you guys! Today I'm going to show you how to turn off the emergency SOS on iPhone. This is super simple, so have your iPhone on hand so you can follow along as we go through. Let's jump right in. So you're going to go to settings, and then you're going to scroll down to emergency SOS. When you click on that, you're going to have a few different options here. So if you don't want any of these on, you're going to turn them all off. Call, withhold, and release button basically means that if you're holding uh, the side button, sorry, the, the power button here and any of the volume buttons, after a certain amount of time, there's going to be a countdown that begins and, a, and an alarm sounds, and your iPhone's going to call emergency services. So if you want that off, you simply just turn it off. The call with five button presses, basically, if you click the volume button five times, it's going to call emergency services. It's normal to want to have these off because if you have your iPhone in your pocket or something and you're triggering these buttons, which has happened to me before, and you don't want emergency services to be called, it can just be a whole thing. So having these off isn't dangerous because you still can activate that emergency services call button by pressing and holding these two. So you want to press and hold the power button and the volume button, and it's gonna bring up the slide to power off, but you can also emergency call as well. So basically what SOS means when you see this in the top right of your phone, it means that you don't have proper uh, cell phone coverage at that moment. So you have an SOS coverage, meaning you can still make 911 calls and emergency services calls. The only way to get your coverage back would be to drive somewhere with proper cell phone service. There's also a couple other ways to do this. You can go into your settings and into your cellular and turn off your cellular data for about 13, 15 seconds and turn it back on. Another way that you can do this is go into your cellular data options and make sure that your data roaming is on. Lastly, if you're still unable to make regular phone calls, you can restart your iPhone. So to do that, you'll hold the power button and the volume button just as before, and you're gonna slide to power off. And once it turns on, it should work. As a bonus tip today, I'm gonna to show you guys how to set up an emergency contact in your health settings. So you're gonna go into your settings, you're gonna go down to emergency SOS, and then you're gonna go down to the bottom to set up emergency contacts in health. It's gonna bring you to this page here to create a medical ID. This is something that the, the emergency dialer can access without having to unlock your phone or anything like that super super helpful to have so basically when you click on that it's going to bring you to this page where you can fill out a whole bunch of information about yourself and here is where you will find add emergency contacts so you'll click that plus symbol and you can go through all your contacts and add however many emergency contacts that you want already thank you so much for watching you guys i hope that this was helpful for you and i hope that you can use this information pass it on to somebody else who needs it thanks for watching and i will see you guys in the next video